Coquille board or stipple paper is a textured surface onto which you apply color pencils to create a kind of a really cool texture. And I try to use stipple paper when it warrants the object. So for example, I wouldn't use stipple paper for an object that's really shiny or slick. It's good for objects that have a texture to them like a shell or a carapace or fur. Stipple paper traditionally comes in large sheets with different types of patterns on it, or you can also get it in a pad. This is a student grade pad of paper. It comes nine by 12. Aside from a drawing pencil, you're going to want to use colored pencils. In this case, I have a black and a dark brown colored pencil. You want to make sure you have a sharpener nearby because you want to make sure you keep your points sharp. I've cut down one of my large sheets of coquille paper into some little squares so I can experiment with it first. So for example, just to get an idea of the gradation, I'm using sort of the side of the pencil and you can see the texture that rises. So that's sort of a lightweight pressure. This is more of a medium weight pressure. to a, a lot of pressure. And again, you can buy different coquille papers that have different uh, patterns on them. A lot of times it's hard to find coquille paper and you might have to order it online. Likewise, here's the brown or terracotta. Again, light medium and dark. Again, I'm not using the tip of the pencil because I don't want to fill in those crevices because those are what are really makes it really pretty texture. I used a pencil and lightly sketched out my shape of my sea star. You can see it has a madreporite and its arms. So I'm going to now use my brown or terracotta uh, color pencil and start creating volume by shading. I dug up some other color pencils because I just thought it'd be more interesting than just adding black as a shadow. It always makes things more interesting if you add color. Black is not a great color to use for a shadow. And I want to give this a little bit more life to it. This side is fairly dark. 